one of our own guys, John Johnson, a.k.a. Indefinite Champ, is playing in that DreamHack tournament down in Dallas. We want to wish you good luck. Take that money home. Okay, we are going over the 4-3 normal. This is the Free Fire 3. This is what it looks like. And just to show you, I'm doing it against a blocked running back. The blocked running back is to the right. Just reverse the setups if the running back is blocking to the left. Just change the side you slide your linebackers to. Against under center formations. Now, here's what we're going to do. Uh, you don't have to baseline unless this guy winds up out here somewhere. If he does, or you want to just get into the habit, baseline, wire triangle right in the D-pad, shift all linebackers to the right, to the side of the halfback. You see, I, I screwed it up because I moved him. Hold on, let me reset the play. So, baseline, shift all linebackers to the right, towards the side of the halfback. Then you want to blitz that right outside linebacker. You want to slant the D-line outside and then take this left outside linebacker. Uh, you can put him in a flat zone or a yellow zone, but you're going to hover right here. Then gets the pass. Hold L2 through the snap. Now when they hike the ball, you still hold L2 and just walk a couple steps to the left. Like hover to the left. Look at that. That's against the blocked running back. So baseline, shift all linebackers to the right, slant the D-line outside, blitz that right outside linebacker, and zone this linebacker. And hover here. And then just hover and walk to the left when they... You want to try and open up that hole just like that. 
baseline, shift the linebackers to the right, slant the D line outside, blitz that right outside linebacker, put this left outside linebacker in a yellow zone, hover right here. So hover, go to the left, go out into coverage. I mean, this looks amazing here. Now, if you guys want to run this from the multiple D ebook, what you want to do is first put this in your audibles in your 4-3 normal set. Then you want to go to 4-3 odd, take out the two middle linebackers, put safeties in. Then when you come out on the field, you want to immediately audible into this play, the 4-3 normal free fire three. This way you'll have, now you'll have two safeties on the field, which will be faster than these linebackers. That's if you want to run this with faster safeties on, on the, you know, as linebackers. Let me just flip the play, show it to you now how you want to run it if the running back comes out to the left. So now you would base a line, shift all linebackers to the left, slant the D line outside. Now you don't even have to put this linebacker in anything else. You could just hover right here. Now let's see how this works. But you see this, um, this DT, his blitz angle is different than than when you're running this from the other side. So let's see how this works. I would still hover and go to the right this time. You know, hold on, maybe you don't even, maybe you could just run this universally the same way, no matter where the running back is. So base line, shift all linebackers to the right, slant the D line outside, blitz that right outside linebacker. Get on this Van Der Esch, put him in the yellow zone, and you're going to hover here. And once they hover, you still hold L2 and walk to the left. Pressure still comes in, so you don't have to flip any sides at all. No matter where the halfback comes out in, you still just do this setup. You don't have to flip the play and do the reverse setups. Look at that. One last time and I'll cut the video. So baseline, shift the linebackers to the right, slant the D-line outside, blitz that right outside linebacker, put him in a yellow zone, hover here, hold L2, walk to the left, and then go out into coverage. The middle of the field will be weak, but this blitz is gonna come in super fast.